Alright guys, let's do it. Okay, so our focus is going to be the Fuseman. We cannot let him have a turn. That's unfortunate. There we go. So again, as long as we can take him out, they will not be shooting the cannon in our face. Man, big time dodges. Alright, he's gonna call in a Fuseman, who's now sitting in the back row. We don't like that as much. We don't have any AoE back there. Should move, no. The ground quakes. Too bad, we'll have to use that attack to take him out. Okay, this is good. We got the Fuseman again in the third position. We have a lot of AoE with that position. Nice. Hmm. This is good. We can now focus this attack right on the cannon. Precision and power. There we go. We do not do as well with this guy in the front position. It's not good. Okay, this is what we like the most. We got the matchman in the fuseman in the third position and the cannon in the second position. That's where most of our AoE's at. Decisive pummeling. Okay. Some big time dodging going on. Hey, oh.
I don't know if that's the right move. It's just, we're barely doing any damage anyway, so I think this will help take out the ads. Okay, now we got the Fuseman in the back. Damn. Okay. Nicely done. There we go. Fuseman is dead. This should take care of him. Oh my gosh. They're dodging his counters, guys. They're dodging his counters. What can we do? Um. I don't want that bad guy dead so the Fuseman goes here again. Nice shot. We don't want this front guy dead, though. And he's going to be dead. No? Oh, the counter's off. All right. It's actually good he's here, because we do more damage in the second spot. We did not bring a group of guys that can hit that front, front spot consistently. Okay. This is what we wanted. Nice. At home amongst the taking it out. There we go, there we go. 